The production phase-out of halon fire suppressants has sparked worldwide efforts to develop alternative total flooding agents. Although the Energen name is relatively new to many in the fire protection industry, this technology has been developed over the past 50 years for a variety of applications, including spaceflight, underwater breathing apparatus, submarine life support systems, and hyperbaric oxygen therapy. Classified as an inert gas mixture, Energen agent suppresses fire by slightly lowering the oxygen content to a level that won't support combustion, while adding a small amount of carbon dioxide to maintain a people-compatible environment. As is expected with all innovative technology, questions commonly arise out of legitimate concerns. Unfortunately, misinformation can also raise unwarranted questions about areas that truly are not of concern. Questions such as the environmental impact of the energy agent, particularly its global warming potential. Energen is comprised of three naturally occurring gases found in the air we breathe. Nitrogen, argon, and carbon dioxide. So when energen agent is released, each of these gases simply resumes its role in the Earth's ancient life cycle. Therefore, as you can easily see, energen cannot exhibit any global warming potential, nor can it exhibit any ozone depletion potential or adverse atmospheric lifetime effects. A second bit of misinformation suggests that energen systems take a full minute to extinguish a fire. To illustrate the true facts, Ansel performed and documented a series of energen fire extinguishing tests following the same test methods required by Underwriters Laboratory Standard 1058. In accordance with UL 1058, all tests were conducted in a 10 foot by 10 foot by 12 foot high draft-free room provided with a means of observing the fire during the test. A standard exit sign was installed at the center of the back wall to simulate how easily exits can be found during and after agent discharge. Adjustable vents on opposite walls near the floor and ceiling provided adequate ventilation during the fire's pre-burn. Probes were located at the base, midsection, and top side of the test enclosure to measure oxygen levels. The oxygen level inside the enclosure was maintained at a minimum of 20% prior to initiating the system discharge. The tests were conducted at Energen's design concentration, which is defined by NFPA 2001 as the extinguishing concentration plus a 20% safety factor. The first tests were run using Energen in a no-fire situation to test for visual obscuration. Only a few seconds after discharge begins, it is already evident that Energen agent does not obscure vision, an extremely valuable characteristic in occupied spaces. And the exit sign remains clearly visible throughout the discharge. The next test sequence shows Energen's performance on a Class A fire. Each Class A test required a wooden crib with the exact size, shape, and moisture content as specified by UL 1058. The ignition source was approximately one-half gallon of commercial-grade N-heptane in a two-and-one-half square foot metal pan centered 12 inches below the wood crib. The wood crib was exposed to the burning fuel for approximately three minutes and then allowed to burn for an additional three minutes, resulting in a total pre-burn time of six minutes. As per UL 1058, the crib was then placed on a test stand approximately 20 to 23 inches above the floor in the center of the enclosure. The enclosure was then sealed, the ventilation equipment shut down, and the energen system discharge initiated.
Just 22 seconds after the start of discharge, the Energen system has already extinguished the crib fire, which is obviously much faster than one minute. A soak period of 10 minutes is allowed at the end of the system discharge before the enclosure is opened. The crib is then removed from the enclosure and observed to make sure there is no combustion, reignition, or free burning embers. The next test documents Energen's performance on a Class B fire. Each Class B test used a two and one half square foot metal pan, six inches deep, located in the center of the enclosure. A minimum two inch layer of commercial grade N-heptane was used to fill the pan to within two inches of its top edge. The fuel was ignited and allowed to pre-burn for 30 seconds. The enclosure was then sealed, the ventilation equipment shut down, and the system discharge initiated. This time, the Energen system extinguishes the fire within 17 seconds of discharge. Again, far sooner than one minute. Just what do these fire tests prove? It is clearly shown that Energen systems do not take one minute to extinguish a fire. In Class A and Class B fire tests, extinguishment was achieved in 22 seconds and 17 seconds, respectively. These results also help to explain two other incorrect claims. The first assumption is that a one-minute discharge allows for higher levels of combustion products, in particular carbon monoxide gas. This is based on the false assumption that a 60-second discharge equals a 60-second extinguishment, which has been conclusively proven to be untrue. Also, separate testing has shown that a 60-second energen system discharge produced less carbon monoxide than a 10-second discharge of Halon 1301. And that leads to another issue, products of decomposition. Because energen agent contains no chemicals like bromine, chlorine, or fluorine, it cannot break down into corrosive and otherwise dangerous decomposition products when it contacts a fire. Therefore, it is not limited to a 10-second discharge. As a matter of fact, when referring to discharge time, NFPA 2001 makes a specific exception for inert gases like energen. The standard states that for inert gases that do not form decomposition products, the discharge time may be extended to achieve the design concentration within one minute. For all other halon alternatives, NFPA 2001 states the discharge time shall be completed as quickly as possible to suppress the fire and limit the formation of decomposition and combustion products. In no case shall the discharge exceed 10 seconds or is otherwise required by the authority having jurisdiction. Deciding on a halon alternative can be difficult. But now you can take a minute and breathe a little easier because at last you have the real facts about energen. The environment friendly, property safe and people compatible alternative to Halon 1301. Experts in Global Fire Solutions.